What's up? Howdy. Welcome to Honey. Backside of Honey. Honey's backside. Honey's back. We spent a lot of time back here. This is where our truck sled is. This is where all of our tools are. Just putting stuff away after a lot of projects. Get in my truck, so I packed up. Oh my god. Woo! Little mate. Woo! Somebody passed my frisbee. So we had a kind of a interesting time here. Been at the golf course for a month. Yeah, exactly a month. We're on an old golf course that was basically um the people that own this golf course before, I guess, made the mixture wrong for treating the grass, which was a huge mistake. Um, they ended up burning all of their 180 acres of really, you know how grass, grass is on golf courses. Well, they ended up frying it all and went out of business. So we're on 180 acres of what is now a beautiful natural habitat. There's deer everywhere and squirrels and raccoons and coyotes and there's no one playing golf here so it's just like this beautiful private place that we've called home for the last few weeks so we should probably tell you guys how we ended up here um because you're probably thinking how are you on an old golf course like how did you get permission well we went in to buy whiskey one night in um, where we were camping before. Brunswick, Maryland. A little town called Brunswick. Yeah. We went into Tri-State Liquors, which is like the coolest liquor store I've ever been to. Just shelves of, of every type of tequila and bourbon and scotch and- I'll show you a video right now of it. Look at this liquor store we're in. This is all whiskey. 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 All whiskey. All whiskey. All whiskey. <laughs> Taking a video for my dad. This, this one's called Hillbilly. He was just showing this one to me. This is made out of wine, old wine barrels. So it has like wine and there. It's like a $70,000 bottle, $50,000 bottle. Really? Oh my god. $70,000 bottle? Jeez. You're ready for the apocalypse. It's It was awesome. And we ended up chatting with the owner he's like oh you guys like this you know try a sample of this so we're boozing with him shooting the shit with him we he, he basically said you want to come camp for free come camp i have huge property so that's what we did this way come on oh. <laughs> not the way home. This way, mate. This way. Come on. Come on, mate. Careful look at that. Those sleepy vibes. They were putting out those workout vibes. Yeah, girl. Yeah, girl. Oh yeah, look at that. <laughs> As you can tell, we haven't showered in eight days. We're about to take it. We're about to take your first shower. First shower. Ever. First shower ever in Honey, but not in Honey. We're gonna do it outside of Honey because the shower areas come our storage area, slash where the cat litter box is, slash where the cooler is, slash where the garbage is, and we could clean it out, and then we'd be fine doing that. But it's such a beautiful day. Look at this beautiful day. So we're gonna shower outside. Um, the grate that we're showering on is kind of hard on the feet. But it feels so good to be clean. It feels so good that we made hot water here. Propane is so cheap. It's crazy. Like we're living so cheap and so free right now. Amazing. Chilling in the hammock. Puppies are napping. Doing some work on the other It's 
Sunday here in Newmarket, Maryland. We are working on some projects. Emmy is uh, fixing little uh, old mate. Old mate. That's what we call our motorcycle, old mate. 1969 uh, Honda Trail 90. It's her new little baby. I'm painting a stripe here, down honey. I haven't decided what I'm gonna do on top of that. It looks a little plain Jane to me. I'm gonna do some new, um, another coat on these uh, fire roasted spots and then add some copper to this new drip cap. Um, but yeah, gotta figure out what I'm gonna do here. We'll see. Two boot. Called a two boot. How to fix a motorcycle air leak caused by damaged boot. Lola, you're a bully. Hey, we've had a good time. I think the majority of all of our jobs being here were all wood refinishing <laughs> projects. Yeah. We did a staircase for Huron, which yep. uh, railing spindles, and then we did kitchen cabinets. And then we did another stair, stairway transformation. So yep. it was a big month lessons of... Everyone's doing it, okay? <laughs> so do it. Take you your know, shitty old oak and paint it. Do your kitchen cabinets look like this? Dated, old, they just need a facelift. I'll show you how it's done. Come with us. I mean, we, Emmy's been doing this much longer than me, but I've been doing it for a few years now. And you're like, oh, like, let's find this paint that you don't have to use primer, or this paint that you, this primer you don't have to sand. Just do all the steps. Just do them all. They're all lies. Because you have to sand and you have to prime. It's such a pain. Period. Actually, anyway, I uh, hope you enjoyed our time here in where are we? New Market, New Market, Maryland. <gasps> Till next time. Hey, till next time. Potato Brown and Emmy. You I don't know. We'll have to come up with your name. She doesn't have a road name. Help yet. me come up with a nickname. I yeah. can't name myself. That's Put it in the comments. The rules. If you think that Emmy should have a road name, what do you think it should be? Um, also, see you later. Working on a fat sign off. <laughs> <laughs>